Hey guys, it's Nicole and today I'll be showing you my desk makeover. As you can see, it's more or less done now. I just really wanted to do a short intro to talk about my desk. So this is a brief history of my desk situation. My desk has traveled to many places across my room, just like all the traveling I'm doing in this season and in the middle of this pandemic. So it was against my wall at one point, then it went to this wall, then it went to beside my bed. So it's been it's been places but i think i enjoy this setup the most because i really have all this wall space and it's just nice i feel like this placement makes the most sense also all links to products will be in the description bar below so without further ado let's get on to the makeover desk tour i do want to say that i have another desk here but it's mainly for other people at least i have this space ready for them but that's not the desk we'll be talking about we'll be talking about this one and i do want to say that this desk is actually from ikea and it is not a desk per se it's more of a dining table because we found it in the dining table section this is the desk mat and i really love how it feels and it makes my desk look so neat it's like a rug but for a table so i feel like it really compartmentalizes and separates the different spaces so this space is more artsy as you can see the easel is here and i put my ipad here because i do a lot of drawing on my ipad i'm still working on it and also this led clock which i've had for a really long time and also my animal crossing edition nintendo switch which was a gift so i'm really very thankful also this desk organizer which i've also had for a pretty long time and I believe you can see me assembling it in my room makeover video. These paint brushes, they're more decorative than anything, but when I do paint, it's really easy to just grab one of these. And also, the washi tapes, which are 
right here hiding behind a Nintendo Switch. Let me just pull it out real quick. And I like how I color coordinated it as best as I could. I do a lot of journaling, so washi tapes are a really easy way to just make the page look more aesthetic. <laughs> now moving on to the monitor and the keyboard. And yes, I am editing the video now, so this is like inception. <laughs> but anyway, this keyboard is the Ann Pro 2. And it is a mechanical keyboard. I got it secondhand, so it was cheaper than the retail price. Now the monitor is a curved screen monitor. Now on to behind the monitor. Let me just put you guys here. So this is the 9 grid drawer and I put some stickers inside. Like here I have some Gudetama stickers and they're super cute and I've had them for so long. Like I have this problem where when I really like something I just can't bear to use it. But anyway, these are some stickers that I actually made. So they're just night stickers and they were inspired by the Queen's Gambit and I like how they turned out but I, I really don't know what to do with them. Also on top I just put some stamps that I made. You can see it in my 50 facts about me video. I was just making stamps. That is what's on top. Also these inks. Two other stickers that I made as well. These are the Animal Crossing stickers. These are just some Animal Crossing stickers and you can see how I made them in my how I make stickers video. But also I have some praise and worship playlist stickers. I just picked some songs that really reminded me of my church friends. Yeah, just made stickers out of it. That is that for this 9 grid drawer. And that's my stationery box. I use all of these pretty often which is why it's here instead of there. And Totoro is chilling at the back over there. Inside it's actually my mini projector and other electronic things. And on this end, I have my phone with the phone stand and also the cutting mat which is really useful when I do crafty stuff. And over here I have my Bible, my journal and bullet journal, and other books I reach for pretty often. Right now I've got a lot of church camps going on and other spiritual growth things, which is why a lot of booklets and books are there. Now onto the wall. You can see me painting these in one of my videos where I talk about my summer goals, so I won't talk too much about that. Finally, this cloud light is honestly such a great buy, and if you don't like this design, they have so many others, so I really recommend it. for this video. I hope you found some inspiration to spice up your desk. I just want to thank you guys for all the support. I know my content has been shifting and changing and I'm trying to figure out what I want to do with my channel. But I think the key thing is that I'm just trying to have fun with it. Like Leah's field note said, YouTube is not my life. YouTube is about my life. So I really want to continue having fun with it because it's the fun that sustains me. And I'm really thankful for all the support and thanks for sticking around. And if you're new here, hi, I'm Nicole. I make vlogs and a whole bunch of other things. I guess that is all for this video. I pray that you stay safe, happy, and healthy wherever you are. Bye.